Hey guys, what's up? Jordan here from Ta Phoenix Tactical Airsoft Team. And today I will be doing a review of my kit, what I run with at VIP Airsoft in Glendale, Arizona. So here I have a Condor plate carrier in multicam, a NC Star one point sling, which I have s slinged onto my shoulder strap so I don't feel any of the weight on my neck. A Condor, just basic dump pouch and Atax. Um, I really like this plate carrier. I'd recommend it for people who are kind of on a budget. It's really good. So, uh, let's move on to my head here. So, here I have an Emerson Fast Helmet. Uh, it's the one in Atax. I try to stick with like the woodland slash green camo type. I have a US American flag patch. On the other side, I have a Arizona flag patch for my mesh area. I have a Bravo just desert camo mesh mask. It goes well with my plate carrier. Uh, for my goggles, I have save face goggles. I'm, I really want to get some revision ones, so I'm probably going to be saving up for those. I have a, a GoPro Hero 3 that I have mounted on the NVG. So, and I also, if I don't use the, uh, the camo one, I'll use this one, the skull one. So, uh, let's move on. So, my gloves, I use Oakley Hardwood gloves. They go for like $70, $80 at the store. I bought these at the store at Scottsdale Fashion Square for $80. I really like them. They protect your knuckles, which are like the worst things to get shot in airsoft. Carbon fiber. Uh, the shiny part that you see is leather. That's real leather. This part up here is like a foam and fabric. The Oakley sign is like a rubber. This that my thumb is on is a, it just feels like fabric. And then this right here is like a foam. The To keep it on, it's just like a Velcro strap, just a normal one. And then, just this thing in the material. Okay, next, I have a, Bravo Smog, just a normal one. I'm probably going to get the Condor Baca Lava or whatever they're called. Just something a little lighter than this because this gets you really hot. So let's move on to my gun. Here I have a AWA MP7 with the magazine. There you go. So here, Magpul pink rail covers, probably going to get those off and just get like a VFC light and put on it. Paracord to hold my sling, because it can't go into the little holes here. NC Star red dot, I want to get a Mach Eotech for this instead of this and replace that. Um, a VFC PEC 15 functioning, it has the light and the laser. I normally just keep it on the light. Um, this is how it sounds when I fire it. So the bolt does catch. There you can see. And then also when I pull that back, the bolt stays. And I can do the bolt release. I'm probably going to be doing a, rev a review of the KW MP7 soon. Like a shooting test and everything. But until then... I'm leaving you guys off here. Hope you guys enjoyed my kit video. Leave a like and subscribe and comment. Thank you guys once again. And this is Jordan from Phoenix Airsoft signing off.